Watford 1 Tottenham 1, Christian Cabasa earns Hornets a point as Sanchez sees red. Real challengers, like Manchester United last week, win at places like Watford. Spurs let them off the hook good and proper. The brutal truth is when Harry has an off day and he had one yesterday all right lesser teams have a chance. Watford took theirs, courtesy of Mr Kane, in more ways than one and Spurs very vocal travelling army of fans left with only distant dreams for comfort. If Harry had finished off a great move involving Delali and Kieran Trippier, as he normally does, Spurs would have been in front within five minutes. And what a miss that turned out to be. Eight minutes later Watford were one up and you could say our Harry was to blame again. Defending may not be his strongest point but Mauricio Pochettino will not have been too happy that Kane allowed Christian Cabasilla free header to meet a corner that the Spurs golden boy probably ought to have got to first. But even if their coach has ruled them out of the title race, there is no denying Spurs still look the part at times. Like they did after 24 minutes. It would not be unfair to say they sliced through Watford like a knife through butter with a magical move that saw Christian Eriksen deliver a cross that beat everyone except Sun who had an empty net to put the ball into. You could not deny Spurs deserved that, some of the stuff they served up was sweet to say the least but their not-so-sweet side surfaced seven minutes after the restart. Watford whiz kid Richar listens too much for Davinson Sanchez. The Spurs defender could hardly complain about the red card Martin Atkinson showed him for a nasty elbow in the Brazilian's face. Being reduced to 10 men did not help Kane's cause but Pochettino denied the strikers off day contributed to the loss of two more points. He said, Harry was very active. I am very happy with him because it is very difficult to play up front on your own in when you are down to 10 men. Pochettino also praised his players for pressing for the win. He said, we have been disappointed in the last few games but the team showed real character and commitment today in not playing for a draw. But the Argentinian was disappointed at the way they conceded a goal. He added, we have talked a lot about keeping concentration and perhaps we didn't for the goal. Watford boss Marco Silva revealed his side had learned from last week 4-2 home defeat by Manchester United. He said, we made some mistakes against them and we were playing against another very good team today. But we tried to do everything to win this match. On Sanchez's sending off, he said, the defender stopped Rich Harlison with the arm in his face. And we should have had a penalty at the end as well when Deere appeared to handle a Rich Harlison cross. But I respect the decisions. I am happy because my players showed fantastic commitment and never gave up.